Welcome everyone. I am Emerald Green and I am the chick who reads. I'll be bringing you intuitive messages directly from spirit. Now um, remember that this is a collective reading. It is general so it may or may not resonate with you. However, if it does, I do ask if you would please hit that like button. And if you feel called, hit that subscribe button and join the family. Now, um, keep in mind with Tarot, energy is fluid. So I could be saying he and it could be a she. I also mentioned zodiacs as well as time, but it is all energy. So flip it around, adjust it accordingly. But please, please, please do not force it to fit. Y'all, I'm going to cleanse my energies uh, on these cards one more time because I don't know who's incarcerated or who's in jail, who's thinking of you collective, but um, that energy I don't want to bring into the reading. I just don't. Um, but somebody definitely thinking of a female. I'm not even going to say feminine energy. It is a female. Someone is in, in they locked up. They in prison could be in their mind, um, but I just don't want to bring that energy of somebody just in their thoughts instead of taking action on whatever it is. Like we we not doing that. Let's let's remove that energy. Okay, so somebody was wearing a mask, some type of truth, and then I hit it. Then the four of wands is shown. So the ace of swords. Somebody said there's a reason you are needed. With no fear, you found me. Okay. Look the man. Somebody was wearing a mask. Somebody is praying for a second. Uh... Hold on, y'all. Let me look at these words. Form of you by Kalani. She said something about a lesson. And it came in the form of you. I see the best version of me through your sight. Uh, this unfolding, this unfolding feels different than the last arm outstretched. I stand here where I am and know that this is, is the top of the world too. Walk on wet sand, look back to see one set of footprints. And know it's because you have carried me through. I pray for a set of lessons. It sounds like she's talking to God. Yeah. This could be a personal message. Somebody is not doing good. They in bad health. <laughs> Um, I'm not laughing when I chuckle y'all. I'm sorry. I don't mean to chuckle, but it's like um, I don't even know where it comes from. I don't know. I, I know I do it, but I don't know why. Anywho, but it's like uh, somebody is not doing well. I, I felt like man down. I just shot you down type energy like somebody is not liking how they're feeling because of something. A lesson that came a blessing that came in the form of you we have family room so this could be something uh, like a family situation we got the main male here somebody could be about to travel or journey something feels like a completion or this traveling will complete or make something whole who sent you here for me I didn't know my karma would come in the form of a human being. Maybe somebody had to go away. We have expectations, thief, and message with the wealthy man in despair. Somebody in jail could be fearful that a message is going to come from somebody who is successful to you. Like their karma is you. Some type of truth. There's something about a home, you know, like a foundation stability. Could be a marriage. Because we got Hierophant here and then the Ace of Pentacles. Like somebody's karma is in the form of them, of you. We have marriage. So somebody is in prison in some type of thoughts. We got Distant Horizon, Great Fortune, and Judication. Somebody could have felt trapped down 
in a marriage or thought that they were trapped and then somebody released their ass and now they're like, damn, I didn't want you to go away. What is this, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels? We got a false person. So somebody was definitely putting on. They weren't being truthful. They were trying to hide what they were doing, but somebody saw them. Somebody was watching. Somebody was watching somebody wear a mask and they had a mask on too. This is a courtship. So somebody could have been wearing a mask or trying to conceal who they truly were, but the other person behind them that was like really watching them is wearing a mask. Like they're not who they say they are, but they're trying to court someone. We got four and eight. I know six and eight is running maze, but I hear R. Kelly, y'all. Honey love and get me some of that honey love. I don't know why R. Kelly is coming on. Somebody feels like somebody is the official pe the official person. I say tonight is your night. Somebody say you don't have to ask for nothing. Somebody's going to come with a gift. So girl, don't be shy. Oh. Y'all see how these cards is laying out? I don't know if y'all can see it all the way. Hold on. Let me turn this so y'all can see how stuff is laying. Oh, from you right now. Somebody wants some honey love. Somebody could call you honey. We got a message of concern about it's like something is concerning someone it's a lot of thoughts somebody wants to travel but it's like they were wearing a mask and maybe they they knew that you knew that they were wearing a mask or maybe somebody is watching you from a distance maybe they can feel like you trying to put on or you trying to cover up of some sort yeah my nose is starting to itch it's like they feel like you're trying to cover up like you're trying to act like you don't want them just as much as they want you but I don't know. 22. Um, somebody. This is like the official. This is your official person. Somebody who's. Their last name could be Baker. It could be a lot of people that watch this person. It's like a businessman or some sort. Because I did see the wealthy man. It's like this person may travel for work or. There's a lot of people that got their eyes on them that's watching this person travel. They could be, you know, in a family setting. This person could be a family man or woman. But I'm getting like there's this family room. Some type of great fortune. Something wasn't communicated or something was communicated or miscommunicated is what I'm feeling. With this message of concern, like... And it has something to do with the, the mask that somebody was wearing. Like they miscommunicated what they meant or what they wanted to say. Because there's a letter that was received. And I'm getting like that's the concern. It's like whatever was sent, somebody is like, damn, they were was wearing a mask. Which caused you to put or conceal your face of some sort. Like, you know what, I'm not going to be vulnerable or anything like that. Um... Somebody is locked up in their thoughts. Why is this family room here? Hold on. Great fortune. This person could have, you know, stability on impeccable. We got community. Something about, I don't know if this person is a major person. Okay, so maybe they play a major role in the community for children. Um, I don't know why I just heard Foster's home for uh, what is it? Foster's home for some type of monsters or our uh, invisible friends or something like that. I can see the blue thing. Then we got gift again. Somebody can gives or contributes to the community of some sort. We got adjudication falling out right aligned with imprisonment. It's like somebody is settling something. This judge is so fucking tired of this shit. 
They uh, this judge is tired of seeing these people in they in his courtroom is what I just heard. You are my lady. Okay, so we had a privileged lady and oh and then adjudication here. So somebody could feel privileged of some sort, which could be the this major concern. Somebody gotta do so, like do a lot of stuff. Um somebody's having to do a lot of unnecessary stuff is what I'm getting. Yeah, I did not want this energy coming out here. I, I, I'm I, tired of the, the past energy, but for some reason it keeps wanting to come out. Somebody wants that honey love. We got this unexpected income. Somebody is about to come and do something or someone is trying to pay someone off. We got mature woman and unexpected income again. So maybe somebody looks at you with this mature or privileged woman. There's like a message that somebody wants to say. I don't know. This person could be older than you or you could be older than them because I see the main male and the main male is younger than the mature woman. So put it as it may resonate for you. Somebody is going to do something in the distant horizon. What's this imprisonment? What's going on with this imprisonment? Somebody could have tried to steal something also. Somebody know how to do a lot of stuff. They know how to turn stuff into like a dream into reality. Like somebody's a go-getter, a doer. We got pathway. So somebody is freeing themselves is what I'm getting. They're transforming. Or there's some type of transformation here with these butterflies. Something changed someone. And maybe it freed them. I'm getting like there's this perspective, this shift in perspective of some sort on how they handled things, how they looked at things when it came to them feeling like they were um, locked down or locked up or imprisoned in some sort of way as far as either in jail or physically, I mean, excuse me, mentally in jail. Can I get one more for this imprisonment, please? One more. One more for imprisonment, please. Where that card go? Did it come out? Yeah, my bad. One more for imprisonment, please. I cannot make this shit up. Somebody changed. This pathway caused someone to change. Like whatever imprisonment. Oh, there was this coming together. This lover's energy that changed someone's perspective. Their outlook on something. Somebody said I can't fuck with you ever again. Something about somebody's trust was uh, broken. Can I get two more for family room and then marriage, please? What's this family room? We got poverty. Wow. Can I get one more for family room, please? It's giving me like somebody. Oh, we got main female. Okay, so somebody could, oh, wow, we got Pathway House and Poverty again, and Mature Woman. So this being family, I'm not, y'all, this is what I'm getting. There's a mature woman that may come in and try to pay off this main female type energy to make her go away. It's like, it's like and it may be vice versa, but I'm getting like, this is a, this family room, this community of people is having a discussion about some type of poverty. And it's three and seven. It's like, this is like an end all be all. Like somebody is, you know, not a positive person or a window to throw it out of type energy. Maybe somebody feels like this main female is not of some type of class or not some type of status. I don't know if these cards got my nose itching or what. Or it could just be, you know, uh, very valid. But it's like somebody's like, no, she's not good enough. 
somebody hid who they were to someone but they were courting they feel like this is the official person like they don't give a damn they and it's like this this hand like somebody's giving this beggar poor person money maybe somebody didn't want to feel like they was you know giving handouts but somebody was traveling to somebody and now it's like somebody is in their head because something about this right here changed how they looked at things changed how they thought about things changed how they envisioned something i don't know who the mature woman is in this situation but it's like um there is a mature woman that's feeling like somebody might be trying to use this as a like their pathway to get a big house or to come up out of poverty of some sort but somebody is like dropping some type of dead weight we've got this home it's like somebody may be selling their home or somebody could be trying to make them feel like they may be in some type of despair the community may be excommunicating them or like if you you know do this you're not going to have this or that or this and it's like they're trying to run this person or stop this person at all angles from being with someone we got expectations and sudden wealth it's like they saying that somebody may be trying to use somebody to get like to come up what is this marriage what is this marriage we got court gift courthouse and main male and great fortune at the bottom of the deck distant horizon child and occupation it's like this something is like somebody sees someone as a like a hard worker who chases after their dreams this occupation is more like somebody um who puts the time and the effort into something it's not like it's going to waste it's like it's for something of their future like somebody who stays up late at night and tailors dresses and then you know there's some type of fashion designer they you know come up and they like build their way up to success i don't know if this is like somebody who's been doing it since they were a child or doing something since they were young or maybe this person has young children and that could be something else but i'm getting like this situation is high honor yeah occupation is some type of success wow somebody is working their way towards success it's like some type of growth and somebody sees that somebody is worth working towards or it's like worth doing something for like giving this gift of something it's like maybe it may not be an extravagant wedding it may be a small courthouse wedding but somebody is feeling like this is due justice of some sort or maybe they want to I don't, I don't know what it is in the courthouse. It's some type of letter, some type of something being acknowledged or recognized. What's the outcome of this situation? I don't want to go too long into it, y'all. We have 18 minutes. What's the outcome of this situation? Because somebody said only for you. We got Tyrese bedroom bully it's a whole bunch of sexual energy i don't know if you and this person connected sexually or did something but this person this person said look i gotta get back to that bedroom with you we got to they got some work they gotta put in oh this person may be trying to start it with the kiss licking on your lips somebody licked your lips collective you did it nasty <laughs> some licking on your lips I don't know if somebody was licking their lips or what. Oh my goodness, my nose is starting to itch again. So possibly, what's the outcome of this situation? Because I, I get like this nine of swords energy. Like somebody is in despair. They're in some type of anxiety, losing sleep of some sort. It's like they can't, I don't know why, I can't eat, babe. There's a coming together that's about to be had. Like there's a decision. If somebody's saying this is the official person. It's set in stone. It's already been designed. This is like started with a kiss, some type of kiss. Like I always heard kissing is something that is most sacred. Me, I am listen, when people who kiss it's sealed with the kiss, if y'all know what I mean. That type of stuff. That's why it's not good to kiss people that you are not in a relationship with or not serious with because that kissing leads to a whole it starts it the f-u-c-k-n and it definitely amplifies 
the ritual that's already going on if you know what i mean if you know you know that's why i'd be like people that be kissing and getting all passionate with it you be wondering why those soul ties be so thick and strong yeah it's it's dangerous when you're kissing look the lovers the official person falls out on the main female again like y'all saw it hit i know y'all saw it because i, I <laughs> if you didn't rewind it look the official person landed out on the main female somebody could be concerned about something somebody could be trying to take something steal their time steal their money it's like maybe that somebody's using a child to to waste someone's time we got 24 6 but 33 and then official official person came out twice and that's uh, master number 22 somebody is worried about someone taking someone something a child or maybe using a child against them or something like the timing may have been wrong or something is up with the time like this child it's like it's tethered this clock is tethered to this man maybe this person is they had some shady shit going on and they passed something they was trying to do on the low that alleyway is like kind of dark and I don't know they look like a shady businessman back there somebody was on some shady ass shit I don't know this this pickpocket here is trying to steal this person's time and this woman is laughing behind their back maybe somebody was trying to make somebody feel like a fool and somebody's concerned about how their image is now that they're older or maybe something from the past um, may steal or take away from their future and that could be concerning this person it's something that they want like a great fortune they want to release the anchors and look the lovers is behind it like this person wants to release some type of dead weight that's what i heard with this anchor because that anchor looks old rusted and not it don't even match the boat anymore it's like set them free set them free by big by a big crit okay somebody is about to set something free i don't know if the turtle doves or what 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 else holy spirit holy angels yeah we did all kipper tonight we got thoughts this is the card that came in in the beginning and the card that's that's there like this is the thoughts somebody was encased in their thoughts i don't know if somebody's trying to figure out this could have been i don't know we got the main, excuse me, the mature man. Maybe somebody's elevated. That could be why the uh, main female and the main male is here on the board. But the main, excuse me, the mature man and the mature woman came out in the deck and not necessarily hitting the board. We got great fortune, coffin, and wealthy man with community. Hmm. Something is having to do with money. When it comes to this wealthy man and what they're wanting to do, somebody is definitely closing the coffin. They're ending something or something with this community, somebody is cutting off or they're doing away with. Or maybe this person closed their back on on this love. For this community that allowed somebody in, or a community to dictate something. Yeah, now this person is in bad health because they thinking about somebody really, really bad. Oh, damn. It's on their mind. They, they want this union, this courtship. And it's going to cause somebody to change. Maybe this person is working hard to get their money together. Maybe something happened to them like they back or something or they're... I don't know it could have been a head injury of some sort well somebody is working really really hard to change or to transition or to do something it's like they're trying to get their money together of some sort I don't know if this is like an empire a family who got money or come from trust like it's giving me like trust fund babies It could be about the children. That's the occupation. Somebody working hard because, oh, and now my computer is trying to slow up. Message. This myth. Okay, y'all, look at this. We got expectation. 
Somebody did something to get pregnant. Somebody may have terminated a pregnancy. Or maybe something ended because they was faking like they were pregnant. But we got a privileged lady, message, wealthy man, and message. This is like um, preparing a message to send and never sending it. That's what I'm getting. We got courthouse. I got my money on me. I bet on myself. Somebody who is not wanting somebody to come into their family unit is saying, I'm going to cut your ass off if you date this person. And somebody is in despair. It's like somebody wants to go against the family's wishes. But it's like they're they they putting it to an end. And honestly, y'all, I watched this movie the other day. And it was like this... this uh. This wealthy man fell off the boat. He was on his yacht. He was BS and he was supposed to be doing going to Spain or something for his father. He fell off the boat, hit his head. His sister wanted to take over the father's company and the father wanted the son to be ahead of everything. So uh, they finally found, not the family, but the sister found the brother. Like and she just left his ass in the hospital. Was like we don't know him. No, don't don't come looking for us. So before the dude fell off the boat this one chick was going in to actually clean the boat because he was having parties and doing all type of crazy stuff and so she was cleaning and they got into it he was like i'm not paying you and she was like you gonna pay me and she was talking trash to him and everything so he's this rich guy most people don't talk to him like that but he was like no and so in all she was going through a lot of stuff she was trying to pass her nursing exam and she didn't have you know support she did have support from her manager her boss or whatever they were like family and so they was like use him you know like have him to go to work have him to help make him seem like he's your husband so she played this mind trick on him he did he actually came in helped the family and everything and it was all beautiful and everything but uh, you know where it got around to the little town or whatever and somebody this dude kept on saying I know his face you know so he finally remembered where he saw the dude from after they were at the beach celebrating her getting her nurse's license and everything like she took his ass through hell had him sleeping in the shed and everything like he did it was like he went to work as a, a construction worker and the man was like that's how your wife treats you that's normal we all go through it she and he was like i just feel like a paycheck <laughs> but they weren't going through what he was actually going through she treated his ass bad but in the end she let him you know start sleeping in the house on the couch and they ended up you know but um it's almost the same thing because the dad was like you know if you like his memory came back after they found him and he saw them and so he went back with them and the father was rich he was like no you if you marry her i'm gonna cut you off and and no inheritance or none of that stuff and uh so she finally like you know what i love him i want so she went after him they they the dude it's a long story but anywho they she went after him he realized that he loved her he jumped into the water to come back towards her and the father was like you know what blah 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 so the butler shows up a few weeks later after he moves in with her you know they start an opera and uh was like well your father the yacht is still yours and it's like worth over 60 million dollars or something so he sells the yacht the father ends up coming and she had three daughters at this so he's playing daddy to these girls like teaching them how to ride bicycles showing them how to you know play baseball like a hope like a real father figure and so he sells the boat to his father they get married the father ends up buying the boat from him like he he falls in love with the granddaughters and everything so it's like the rich dude didn't have any kids but the, the woman did and it's like it was one of those fairy tale type story endings but it ended like it did and it's like you know what dad that could be real but this is giving me that same energy like somebody is of wealth or affluent background and there's this somebody that they connect with and it changes their whole outlook and it's like People in different places of high stature that have money, you know, they look at things and they may not, not have the same perspective as somebody who has less money because they've never been through that situation. Or, you know, it's like you don't realize what it is until you actually put your feet in somebody else's shoes. And that's the energy that I'm getting here. Like somebody did not realize that 
your statue or the type of person you were, even though you didn't have money, the love that you gave or something that happened. This person is like, this is my person. I know this is my person. This is who is going to be my person. This person wants to give the gift, even if they have to do it away from the family and it be low key, just y'all. But it's like they can't get the shit out their head. Make it go away. They want it to go away. They want to listen to their people, the people of their community. But it's like they can't. The lovers is here. No matter, even if they do have children, um, wherever the children may be, it's like they're not satisfied with the mate that they have their children with. And it's like something about this energy. They feel like this is set in stone. This lover's energy is like somebody is the official person. And I don't know if the community is trying to tell this person no. This ain't how it's supposed to be. This is not how it's going to go. You're going to mess up everything. I don't know. Collective. I'm going to end it there. I do want to thank you all for your time. And stopping by. I truly truly appreciate each and every one of you. Now as always. Please remember being wanted. Feeds the ego. However being valued. Feeds the soul. So. If you are out and about in the community or whatnot, I do ask if you would please bless some stranger with a smile. You just never know who may feel invisible. But until the next time, make it a great day, my beautiful people.